Breaking the Chains In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins. Ephesians 1, 7 We found our visit to Christ Church Cathedral in Stone Town, Zanzibar, deeply moving for it sits on the site of what was formerly the largest slave market in East Africa. The designers of this cathedral wanted to show through a physical symbol how the gospel breaks the chains of slavery. No longer would the location be a place of horrible atrocities, but it would become a picture of God's grace. Those who built the cathedral wanted to express how Jesus' death on the cross provides freedom from sin. In him we have redemption through his blood. Paul in Ephesians 1.7 Here the word redemption points to the idea of the marketplace with someone buying back a person or item. Jesus buys back a person from a life of slavery to sin and wrongdoing. As Paul begins this letter, he bubbles over with joy at the thought of his freedom in Christ. He points to God's work of grace through Jesus' death, which sets us free from the penalty of sin. No longer are we slaves, we are set free to live for God and His glory. Have a great day ahead. God bless you.